Yes, yes. You are, man. Yes, bro. How's it going? Yeah, man. Good, you? Yeah, good. Good. Busy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's it. So, uh, new track. We're hitting that up today, yeah? Yeah, man. Yeah. I just got a push two. An Ableton push two. It's fucking useless. <laughs> it's like a... Like a... Little Fred again thing. Yeah, pretty much. Fucking 600 quid and it does fuck all, but I got <laughs> one, so... You know, is what it is. Money well spent. Yes, money well spent. So, so yeah. Hop in. Yeah, let's hop in, bro. Let's go. Right. How do you get rid of this little zoom bar at the top? Oh, yeah, everyone fucking talks about that. I can't actually see it. I think you just drag it. Should be able to drag it out of the way, hopefully. Oh, yeah, sweet, sweet. Fucking fuck knows why it does that. I think uh, I think I found a shortcut to get rid of it, actually. Was it M? No. Oh, fuck knows. I can't remember. Oh, I'm onto it, though. I'm onto it. Um, out of the way. Yeah. Oh yeah, press. I think if you press Alt, it gets rid of it. Apparently. Oh, or, uh, like that. I, I don't even know what Alt is on a on a map, but <laughs> uh, command maybe or option. I don't know. Yeah. Nah, it's cool though. It's out of the way. All right. So, how many how many lessons have we done? What is this like? Eight. I think this is eight. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. Sweet. All right. Let's hear this uh, track. Did you share the sound? Yeah. Oh, do I need to? Uh, yeah. Do the little. Get to the trick. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Pause, 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 pause. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, we need to route the audio through Zoom because it sounds like a fucking potato at the moment. <laughs> uh, we need to like go settings. And... I love the sample though, classic. Oh, it is. What the fuck? It sounds like quite tinny. Oh, I don't know why that is. <laughs> Bro, it sounds like 128 kbps on my end. It, it could like be the sample, I can't lie. Yeah, it might, it might actually be the sample in it, yeah. Okay. Alright then. Go on. Whoa. Bro, it's very loud, like, we, one of us could die here. We need to turn the master down. Turn the master down. <laughs> it's redlining. Okay. My CPU is going mad. Bro, it sounds like a blender. Yeah. Blender at one BPM. It's okay. It's because I had to I've already had to like flatten and like freeze like you were saying. Fuck. Last track. Um yeah. But yeah, I mean it's been working fine for me, like kids were on a zoom call, it's a little bit. You could you could, you could, <laughs> <laughs> you could bounce out as an MP3 and send it to me, and then I'll listen to it. Yeah, yeah, I think I sent it to you on WhatsApp. Oh, yeah, okay, I'll just, I can open WhatsApp on my PC. Bro, I'm going to unplug this push too, and I'm going to fucking plug it in later. Wait, so heavy, bro. Look at this fucking size of it, piece of shit. <laughs> Swap that out, and then put my fucking DJ decks there, because I actually use them. Uh, got the fucking RX, the, the FLX4, sorry. I, have you seen the, the uh, new deck they've brought out? It's, it's like a four channel all in one. Yeah, the FLX10. Yeah. I literally. Think, literally. It's cool, bro. It looks so ugly. Yeah, it's butters. Um, and I've just bought FLX4 and they're like, oh yeah, let's make an FLX10. Like, <laughs> fucking dickheads, bro. Like, it's hard, it, it, they're so shit. Um, 
But they yeah, that, they? they're cheeky. They're so cheeky. They know what bro, they're, like, doing. they're like, okay, we're gonna, they're like FIFA in it. They're just repackaging the same thing and then putting it out. Like, you know, it's just like every fucking few months, it's like, oh, let's make the same product. It yeah, clearly see what the difference is between the like DJ thousand and yeah. that, what is it, the FLX four yeah. or is it another one? The 10, the 10, apparently it, it has stems in record box. So I don't know if that's coming as an update, but there's stems in, um, in uh Serato, you know, have you used yeah, to yeah. use the Serato stems yet? They're fucking nuts. You can like split tracks up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, apparently it's coming to record box. Yeah. All right, here we are. Let's fucking get this cracking. <sighs> <laughs> Fucking hell, it is 128k VPS, bro. Jesus Christ. <laughs> no wonder I was like, bro, that sounds mash up. I just like, it's just a little YouTube rip. Yeah, we, we need to get a better version of that, I think. <laughs> what is this, like a Khan and Neek song or something? I just got it off a documentary. Oh, sick. Bro, it's very distorted. Like everything's clipping, basically. Yeah, yeah, no. So we, we, yeah, we need to, we need to get it out of the clipping because it's clipping. Like it's like you basically chop the arm off of the whole mix. Like there's no fucking. It's not like oh, it's just the fingertips. Like the, the arm is missing. <laughs> like if I play it too loud, I'm gonna get tinnitus, which is good, but. No, bro, it's definitely the mix, but that, that could literally kill someone. If you played that in a club, someone would get tonight's, bro. <laughs> That's fucking tap, bro. What the fuck? It's like, <gasps> Jesus, bro. What the fuck happened there? So, uh, tonight, is it? Like, the elements are good, but... Need some work on the mix. Yeah, bro, if you put some proper headphones on your hair, like, the bass is distorted as fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is, is, I remember someone gave me that feedback on my first track, and I was like, what do you mean it's distorted? But like, going back, looking at it, it was distorted, and he was right, and I was like, okay, fair yeah, enough. Yeah, yeah. But... Now, to be fair, I don't really wear my headphones when I'm making it, I just use the laptop speaker. So... Right, right, right. Like the headphones in. It sounds like they've done the, the mix down on like a Sony Ericsson. <laughs> 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 oh, fucking hell, bro. That is so funny. Oh, the elements are there. Anyway, so do you want to like, we could like collect all and save and then you could send it to me and we'll mix it down on my project on my computer and then I'll send it out. I yeah, yeah. About it. yeah. That's that good. seems like a logical thing. So when are you going to Australia, man? Uh, May the 17th. We're behind Holy the fight sh tonight. Yeah, lit. Yeah, mate. It's That's so lit. It's like, it feels like it's all coming together, you know, like we've had that idea for a while. We had to get the visa sorted and all of that. It's a bit long, but. Well done, mate. What's, uh, what's your email? Uh, contact at musicworkflowacademy.com. Yeah. Oh, bro, I was wondering, can you do me a favour? Yeah, yeah. I know now's not the best time, but um, like, I was, could I get a testimonial for you? Because I feel like you're going to go to Oz and then we probably won't be able to see each other that much. So would you be able to be like. Just be like, oh, hey, it's Jack, aka Hi Jack. Like, I've been making music with Omar for the past few weeks. He's helped me with my mix downs, and I feel more comfortable with Ableton. Do you be able to do that? Yeah, man, for sure. Oh, wait one sec. Oh, can you do it now? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, all right, I'm going to count you in, all right? And then just, just waffle, like, how sick everything is and how you've made your new best friend. All right, I'm going to mute myself. All right, I'm going to count you in five, four, three, two, one, go. Hey, guys, it's Jack. I've been working with Omar for a good few months now. Um, I started in January working on my production and he's helped me a lot with uh, like the mix downs, getting creative ideas, starting new tracks. And he's also well helpful with things like uh, DJing, making a brand for yourself, getting music out to labels, things like that. So, yeah, if you're thinking about starting a career in music, definitely uh, get involved with Music Workflow Academy. Easy, you smashed that. I think that's the best testimonial we've got. <laughs> gift of the gap, gift of the gap. Let's go. You G, you absolute G. You get a free master for that. Thank you, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Jackpot. Okay, so. Oh, 
Nice man. Some people get so nervous, especially girls, like, I haven't done my makeup today. <laughs> no, I haven't. <laughs> you yeah. got a bit of lippy on, man. Right. Cracks been sent over. All right, look. Okay, we transfer, yeah? Oh, shit, I just did it on Google. Oh, okay. Um, I'll, I'll find it. I'll find it. Gmail. Okay. Uh, okay, no problem. I've, I've just recently upgraded to... Um, to uh, all right cool yeah just recently upgraded to wait how do i check, check, check. all right got it so i could hear myself then um all right so we need to actually bounce this out properly so there's there's a way of doing that obviously just the als file it's going to be like samples missing stuff oh, like okay. that yeah, yeah. so we need to bounce it out properly so Go share your screen and then um, I'll show you how to do that. What was I going to say? I was going to say I was literally in the middle of a conversation and then I started hearing my own voice. I can't remember, but um, yeah, fuck knows, bruv. But yeah, uh, something about girls needing to wear makeup. <laughs> all right, so uh, live. Uh, all right, so basically you do, uh, first you need to save it to the desktop. This is so booky, but it's the way to do it. So desktop, see, so save the project to your desktop and then you go and do, once that's done, you go file and then you go collect all and save. And yeah. this is going to make like a folder uh, on your desktop. And then once that's done, then you send it to the folder to me and it'll have all the samples everything and then it will load the project so that's how you want it. if you want to collab on ableton that's how you do it it's a fucking ball lake but that took me fucking years to figure out how to do that because it's like some sort of code uh and then sometimes it doesn't work but here we go so we got that so you want to send me that we can compress it and then oh yeah i was gonna say i got we transfer pro that was it because it has like we transfer caps transfers at like two gig but the pro is like a terabyte or some shit so you just send like the hair stuff uh we we trans all right cool mate i saw your bloody cheater in a wwe wrestler oh yeah yes 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 <laughs> so random <laughs> yeah 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 she's doing it for her uh walkout she's gonna like mix and stuff she's sound um, uh that was my last testimonial that was number 19 you're number 20 so shout out it's a good number thursday tasks upload jack testimonial uh yeah man so i honestly like i have imposter syndrome quite a lot like i don't know what the fuck's going on sometimes <laughs> hey, it seems like <laughs> like that that one with like a few million on instagram and then a wwe wrestler no, I used to love WWE back in the day. Yeah, WWE's lit in it. So good, bro. She's sick as well. Like, if you see her, she's sick. Um, but isn't that crazy? Like, I can't believe it. Like, it's just happening. It's all happening. Um, like, I have oh, got a oh, oh, desktop. Yeah, bro. Like, fuck knows. Do you know what I mean? Like, you just, you just don't. And then it happens. You're like, what the fuck? Like, yeah, it's, yeah. It's nuts, man. All right, did I compress it? Um, oh, it's still compressing right. so yeah it's obviously a wham file but yeah yeah we've had her for like since like we've had her for like six seven months bro like some of our students are big like we've got verified singers uh rappers in london i work with it's all legit man like it you, it, do, it doesn't sound like shit but it's <laughs> i'm doing it bro like i'm doing it <laughs> and um yeah i got i got a singer with 130k she messaged me the other week and she was like, can I work with you? I was like, yeah, sweet. So I don't know, man, just consistency, isn't it? Consistency. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, it's which... a lot of genres as well. Oh yeah, everything. You've got to be clued up on like, all your music. I am bro, that's it, that's it, that's it. No one's ever, no one ever really appreciates the, the versatility that I bring, so now it's time to monetize that. And uh, every genre, bro, drill, fucking pop, you name it. So mm, we're gonna, we're gonna a drill tune. What you want to make a drill tune? No, no, just me rapping over the top. Yeah, what you want to spit on one? No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Some fucking CBBC drill <laughs> jokes. Four p.m. Uh, hey, one. <laughs> 
it's to do 4 p.m it is a lot though running a business is fucking hard bro like oh is it just you just me bro like no one can believe it like i do the sales marketing tutoring uh fucking the, the making the music the fucking hiring the firing the mastering it's a lot but okay. this is what it is bro because i'm a one-man army obviously one day hopefully maybe hire you or something like <laughs> once you come back from Oz's job there you can just teach teach Ableton bro make content with me um, that's the life uh, work on my mixing a little bit first oh my god bro yeah no you're not mixing no fucking <laughs> no projects <laughs> music workflow academy .com. but yeah we'll get you there uh original zip oh your email do you want to just type in yeah or something. but so, sometimes like my self-esteem fluctuates i don't know if you can relate but like i feel on top of the world but yeah i just started like uh therapy and shit on my second session and like the guy who's in the mirror he and what i've done is not who i feel like i am i feel like i'm someone else it's fucking weird like i feel like i'm my, myself as a kid because i got bullied and shit so <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, I'll tell you. I'm, I'm like stuck in that like inner child and like I can fight now like I'm, well, I've got loads of accomplishments but I'm st like in the mirror I see me but I don't feel like that it's fucking weird it's weird uh, I don't know if it's imposter syndrome or like um, a wounded inner child or some shit they keep talking about that like some sort of uh, psycho psychology stuff I'm not too clear yeah 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 no, mate, I watch a lot of podcasts and it does seem like everything that happens to you when you're young is what, like, really defines you when you're older. For sure, for sure. For sure, that's that's what they're saying. It's so. about, like, easing it into a, in a, like, a positive way mm. instead of letting it get on top of you. It's fucking been and on top of you. good. Yeah. Therapy. Mate, you should have seen me last week. I was fucking on my deathbed mate i don't think i've ever been so ill i got taken to a hospital in an ambulance what the fuck bro what happened you okay i only had tonsillitis but Jesus. Also I, had, I had um meningitis uh, hell. Symptoms, so they, they take me and do some tests That's but mate i was like in bed for a week like absolutely fucked bro sorry to hear that man. it was <laughs> you know oh. funny looking back <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah <laughs> That's funny. At least you got a sense of humor about it. Some people are like, <laughs> they're like, well, I got to hospital and then this girl, this the, like this nurse comes in to take my blood, and it's this girl I went to school with, and I'm just there like head in hands, like shivering, sweating, <laughs> like, oh, how you been? How you been? All of this. I'm like, mate, I'm literally dying. <laughs> oh, bro, for fuck's <laughs> sake, that is so mate, funny. Good shout out her if you're watching. Shout out, yes, <laughs> big ups. <laughs> Looking after my man Jack, the boy. Do you do you follow Andrew Tate at all? Nah. Fair. Do you? you uh, right? I, I I follow him because like he's he's been locked up for four months and he's not done anything wrong, which I think is a bit dodgy. But fuck knows, it's a sticky one. It's a sticky one. Like you you've got to be top G. I think you've got to be careful who you back in today's climate because you people can lie on the internet like like do you know what I mean like I don't know if you've seen HS Tiki Toki and shit like that there's loads of people that like prophesize themselves as gurus and they're like just fucking dossers and like nonces and... <laughs> they seem like I don't know that HS Tiki Toki guy they just seem like I don't know just like super coked up blokes yeah yeah basically I think you're on the ball there uh, making money so you know but yeah, i don't get how yeah. like, they they're big on like like they came through on tiktok but then i like all their shit is just like them like smoking zoots on balconies and getting <laughs> pissed and going to parties and i swear tiktok's meant to be well on that yeah yeah you're right, but, like, you're right you yeah. say anything out of line like they take your video off and shit like that so but no fair enough yeah but no, i was a bit late on to andrew tate mm. like so I, I don't have TikTok, and then did he come through on TikTok really? So uh, I missed like his whole like the whole come up. I only heard about him when you know everyone started hearing. Him and 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, he... that thing where you can get clips saying something, and then it takes the whole conversation out of context. Yeah. But he has come out with some pretty booky statements. Like... Very booky. <laughs> yeah, very booky. So anyway, it, 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 let's not talk about that shit because it's fucking <laughs> like when you when you back someone and like they're actually in the wrong. It's not good. Do you know what I mean? Because you're backing someone and like, oh, this guy's yeah, yeah. he's innocent, but you never know. He might have fucking done something that you don't know about. He's, yeah, mate, he's locked up for a reason. You never know. Oh, Kelly fans. Oh my god, that's a huge one. Like <laughs> literally, literally, like that's huge. Like, imagine you're backing him and then, oh, weird. And that means it was such a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Oh, <laughs> peak. And they're cracking down on vapes at the moment as well. Like I normally get the Elux Legend bars, but they, yeah. they, because kids are getting them in schools and shit, and they're like, yeah, I literally just saw like a little BBC video, <laughs> like, and it's like this twelve-year-old guy, and like, if I don't have one for a couple of days, I get well grumpy with me mum, and everyone's like, mate, I was smoking weed at thirteen, like, I'm yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was smoking weed like, since I was twelve, bro. Games, I, I do kind of get it though, like you're young. When I was like 12 and 13, we were like trying to find a cigarette or older kids and shit like that, thinking we're cool. I think it's just kind of part of growing up. Yeah, of course, of course. The the prohibited things, you're like, you want what you can't have. Yeah, yeah. And um, did you see where he's like, oh, if I can't find a vape, I'll walk for a mile to get one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like he's some kid in Africa going for water. Like, yeah. and, and there's a clip of him walking How around. And he's that like... That's like a 20 minute walk. <laughs> <laughs> Priceless, but they fucked it now because I used to. I like those Elux Legend bars; like they were nice. What are they banned now? They they don't sell them in offies now because people are buying them, giving them to kids, and it was getting you know just stupid what, people. What are the options then for disposable vapes? So are they just getting rid of them completely? They've got like they're just shit ones left, basically. Like there's a Lost Mary, which looks like a little fucking kids toy. Mm. Look, I've, I've got a few. I'll show you some. But yeah, they're fucking useless, mate. Like, and then there's like these little crystal ones that are shit as well. There's like a crystal one like that, which is all yeah, right. Yeah, it's all yeah. right if you can't get a fucking legend by them. There's the little fucking lost Marys that looks like a little fucking. Oh uh, yeah, mate. They're so um, gay, bro. So far, <laughs> so... they look like. What happened to the elf bars? Yeah, there's still elf bars, I think, but. But in terms of like flavors, like for me, the Elux Legend bars were nice in it. Like I had the flavor I like was called Unicorn Shake, and it was fucking nuts. It was like bare fruit. But um, personally, I just think everyone should uh, grow up and just smoke ciggies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, got, I'm having a little. I'm having a little like detox because uh because I was so rough and I been getting like tonsillitis not that regularly but more regularly than usual and i'm putting that down to the fact that like i started smoking probably like a year ago and um so i'm having a little a little break from them at the minute and it's not it's not that bad mate good 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 i'm sure Uh, i think like obviously fags are bad but like do you know what i mean like they are yeah, they yeah. are nice. I get what you, get what you mean, but I'd like to get back to the stage where like, I just have one if I'm having a drink or if I'm out with my mates. Yeah, be like you know I'd have like two or three a day. Mm, yeah. Oh um, god, I remember I just that. Sat oh, home, I'd just have a few a day. Yeah, I used to fucking chain smoke straights when they were cheap. Like, I'd do like twenty a day. Like when I was like I it's eighteen or something. I'm sure, like, what <laughs> what am I doing? Yeah, get, yeah. yeah. Mate, I, I went to a, I worked at like a kids camp in America last summer and it was like on our break i would just go to the smoking area and just like oh my god so but it's just because of them, them kids were so stressful and they wouldn't <laughs> let you, if they let me go for like two cigs or like three cigs that like spread out in the day that'd be fine but it wasn't you could only have one hour to oh get your kids in so well you've got to get enough nicotine in you to last the whole time <laughs> so funny so many nitty times, like it's just <laughs> nitty. Had these things, uh, like weed wasn't legal in the state, but it was called Delta Eight. It's like a, it's kind of like a halfway between CBD and THC, <clears throat> and it kind of chilled you out a little bit. And literally, mate, the whole camp was just smoking on them constantly. Like. Oh, 
Look. Yeah. Hopefully none of them are watching. <laughs> yeah, if you're watching, please like refrain. I'm joking. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if we can post this actually. There's too much incriminating shit going on here. Like <laughs> looking after kids, stoned and anti <laughs> Yeah. No, this we can't post this. <laughs> we can't post this. It's a great. We're having a great chat. We just. Yeah. yeah. I reckon just put it all after the testimonial. <laughs> Yeah, so it just goes to black and then it just goes to <laughs> some chat and shit for like 20 minutes. Oh, that's brilliant. Okay, finally. Yeah, but if, if you have any ideas for like what we can do to improve or like, you know, any tutorial ideas, just uh, let me know. And then, uh, you know, if anything comes to mind, you can always uh, WhatsApp me it, and then I'll, I'll do it. I'll do anything. <laughs> anything. <laughs> Uh, brilliant yeah fucking some of the requests we get on like youtube and shit i'm like i'll fucking do it because it helps someone do you know what i mean they're like can you show yeah, me yeah. the most common ones are like how to import songs into record box or how to import sample packs i get that like every fucking lesson i'm like oh man come on man. <laughs> jesus christ rip and drag <laughs> i get it it's not fair <laughs> two-step process um yeah let's see have i found any good drums tunes recently uh yeah, i heard a few you've uploaded a couple dmb tunes the drums are sick on them oh thank you mate what like these ones i did a 160 track yeah mate um no, let's just download it <laughs> and then this little fucking noise just gets quicker and quicker and then <laughs> That's kind of what I make. Yeah, yeah. What was it 160? That was 160. This was like a jungle, uh, a liquid tune. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, man, big up. <laughs> big up, big up, big up. All right, let's see. Can we... Can we, uh, I feel like I should have a bigger ego. Like I'm quite humble. I don't know what it is. Like, I'm just, I'm not really that, do you know what I mean? Like some, the, the things I do are sick, but I just don't really get gassed over it. Like I don't big myself up that much. You know? Yeah, you should get everyone at the start of every lesson. Just go like, oh my, you're the best. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you get everyone just come suck me off and then that's <laughs> fine. <laughs> All right. Whoa. Why isn't this, uh, uh, yeah, I'm, de I'm, I'm debating whether to go to Ibiza in May or save my money because Ibiza is good, but it's not that good for a chill out, if that makes sense. Like, it's very, yeah, yeah. it's fucking heavy, bro. Ibiza is heavy. All right, so these fucking samples. Come. It should. Uh, let's see. One sec. It should. Maybe I need to unzip it. Um, basically, yes, yeah, so if I drag that onto the hard drive, it should identify all these sounds, but, um, but yeah, I had a fucking, uh, a gold medalist snowboarder the other day. He wanted to do lessons with me. Why? He was like, yeah, man, I was on ketamine all last night, man. I was like, sick. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, it was a spiritual experience, man. Like I went with my spirit guide and I was like, okay. Uh, Okay. Yeah, I was like, okay, bro. Like, sounds great. Like, okay. I was like, yeah, I was like, well, you're not in a warehouse. Like, <laughs> <laughs> he's like, no, man. I was with my spirit guide. I was like, okay, bro. And uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I didn't really want to work with him. He was a bit. Thought he was cool. 
People think they're cool, but they're not. That's that's what fucking really gets me annoyed. <laughs> ah, mate. They say ketamine. Okay, it's not. It's not right. Kill me, man. It was. Uh, it was. A, yeah, Keza, bro. <laughs> fucking shards, whatever you want. Like, <laughs> don't matter. Ketamine. All right. How how the fuck are we gonna? Oh, what's going on here then? So, so that goes there. Fuck me. Come on. Come on, Ableton. Get with the program. I can fucking find them. Kick analog. Look, they're here. You twat. Uh, so yeah, it looks like I've got to swap them in manually for some reason, which is just great. Uh, all right, there's got to be a faster way. They're, they're in this folder, bro. All right, search folder. Yes, here we go. Uh, da, 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 is that the top there? If you go oh, on, yeah. on the oh yeah, sweet. Okay. Yes, son, let's go. Wicked. Wicked. All right, now there's some. Is there any still bad shit missing? Apparently, what's this then? Oh yeah. Okay. We don't have the but we didn't have the film sample for some reason. Ah, uh, it's calm. Where will, where will that be? Where will that be? Film, wait, if I search for it. Film. Come on. Uh, all right, maybe not. All right, we've, we haven't got the sample. Anyway. Whoa, I forgot what we were doing for a sec. Jesus Christ. This is fucked. Okay. What is so loud at the start? There's something that's just fucking peaking. Yes, yeah, this. Okay. Bro, we can't use this because it's so, um, why is it so like tinny? I mean, I basically, I've like done my version of mixing it and then, and then I've like freezed all of that. I see. And flattened. So it's probably what I've done. It's so loud. Three nine five two six two. That's fucking loud as fuck. <laughs> it's okay, we'll get there. I'll mix it down quickly. It doesn't take me long. That's fucking loud, bro. It feels like my speakers are on like twenty thousand. Like <laughs> cool FM vocal. <laughs> All right, so. We want to keep like the bit of the low end, but all right, that's better. All right. So you see now we're not redlining. Yeah. That's good. All right, we've got the morgue one shot. Genius. Uh, let's turn it down a bit. Bro, your tracks are so sick. I'll send to one of my students. He lives in Nottingham. He's like, no, I don't know if it's Nottingham or Sheffield, but he's more baseline. And then he started making drums. I was like, I might pay with my student Jack because you both make like, like Jack makes sick ju like jump up, and it would, it would help him kind of. I think it's uh, I think it's this. <laughs> Most Londoners are winding down for the weekend. The younger generation is only now. Okay. Um, you know that like choiry kind of is it this? It's the top one. Oh, okay. Oh no, the top in the green. All right. Uh, oh yeah, sweet, sweet, sweet. Yeah, this needs to go down a bit as well. And also a panning tip if you right click on this you can split it and it'll go left and right. Just gives it some some width. Most Londoners are winding down for the weekend. The younger generation is only the radio stations. Very, 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 very important. They played the tune on that. Stations. 
Fucking hell, bro. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> you getting my money's worth. Mate, mate, I'm literally... You work. This is... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, funny, man. I remember there's this one guy. What's that, bro? I said I thought that snare roll was going to be very loud. Yeah. <laughs> Most Londoners are winding down for the weekend. The younger generation is booming up into life. It's the radio stations. Very, 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 very important. They played the tune on Dub Dub Day. The DJs played it out in the club. Drug dealers are prepared to pay quite a lot of money to get their adverts on these commercial radio stations. So the threat is being taken very seriously. <laughs> Okay, there is no audio unit VST. I have serum. <laughs> <laughs> this is crucial to be fair. There we go. Hopefully it loads the preset. No, brilliant. Um, fuck. All right, so do you wanna send it to me or something? To me, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. What's the best way of doing it? Um, let's see. Da, 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 da. Oh, why is it? Why is it not just like, you know? Anyway, all right. Let's go. Open your side, and then uh, we'll. Uh, I'll, I'll help you get it out. Okay. Fucking the weather's nice today. Fuck for that, Jesus! <laughs> Down the day where I am. Really, fuck's yeah. sake, bro. Fuck. It's been oh. wet and wild. That's <laughs> how we like it. I'll show you. Um, I'll show you. But look, it looks like I'm in a Sheikah Island. I don't know if you play Warzone. Wait. I don't play Warzone. All uh, right. I don't know if that's a it's fucking cool, really. good shot. Can you see? It? Yeah, man. It looks like it's bare sunny because the camera's just shit. like. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Anyway, it is sunny. I mean, camera can't really pick it up. Anyway, all right. So, so we'll get the um, the uh, all right. We'll get the uh, what were we doing? Oh yeah, the preset. So yeah, basically, I think we'll need the the jump up bass and the subby bass, and then if you just hit settings on them, like the, on the on the serum, uh, just a little. Oh yeah, 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 that guy. And then if you go menu, oh, actually, what we'll do is we'll save it, save it, save it, save it, and then we'll make a new folder yeah you know, on your desktop. Like we'll call it new folder, and we'll call it like original pirate material uh, serum presets. Yeah, sure. And then this is, is this the intro base? This is the subby base, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so we'll just call this like subby base. And then you're going to send these to me and then I'll just put them in subby. Subby base. Hmm. Strange. Normally it just... Uh, would like transfer over with a lot of it. Yeah, and what I'm scared is like, what if these automations don't come through I'm just gonna be peak let's see oh this is off anyway this intro base is off so i'm guessing oh, Dip i don't think it's meant to be but oh okay <laughs> <laughs> but... oh it's nice as well oh it's really good the younger generation is only now. all right well, well, well i'll turn it back on my project and then um oh my god bro so you're making my head fall off of this <laughs> uh let's see uh save uh save no, we want this one. Oh yeah fuck you now what am i doing bro my head's melting uh presets i went to that award ceremony as well i don't know if you saw i went to like some award ceremony yeah yeah what was that uh it was uh, a business champion awards they nominate me for young entrepreneur of the year so no. so i won but it was weird it was it? It, yeah i was like an in-person award Congrats. So, you have to do a little speech at the top 
bruv, they didn't let me do a speech. I had one ready. They're so, so unorganized. I was like, they said at the start, they were like, oh, no speeches. I was like, what? Like, if it was the Oscars or like, do you know what I mean? If you're gonna go big, go yeah, big or yeah. go home, like speech settings. All right, control, control, base. Done. All right, so we've got two, then we need to jump up base. Um, jump up base. Um, and then desktop presets, jump up base. All right, we've got three of them. Ah, oh, jungle wobble. <laughs> Have you got, um, have you, are you on MuseRec yet? Yeah, yeah. Oh, sick. Uh, DMB Academy, I don't know if you know about them, but they've got yeah, count, yeah. Counter Strikes, uh, Serum Bundlers on there, so I got that. <laughs> what, what, sorry? Yeah, uh, Counter Strike, he's like a, a Neurofunk producer. Oh, they, yeah, yeah. He's done a deal with them and he's got like a big Serum pack. Oh, yeah. And it's behind a paywall, but obviously with, with MuseRec you get it for free, so. Yeah, yeah. Um, it, I haven't used it yet, but I've always wanted to know if they're any good. Um, jungle, 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 and I got a document one serum pack as well. I think. Jungle. I think I downloaded that as well. Oh, sick! I haven't used them, bro. Like I typed in D and B and went through all the packs, and I just downloaded fucking loads of them. So. I think there's a dark minimal one that was going to be good, but have I spelt wobble wrong? No. No, I'm, I'm, I'm having a fucking wobble. <laughs> Save. All right. So jungle wobble. Wait, is everyone is everyone's projects this complicated? I feel like no, 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 bro. Yours. This is by far the most difficult fucking project I've probably dealt with all year. What about the first one? No, this is worse. This is worse. Down, down vote. One like equals one prayer. This is not the one. Uh, we can probably this full corner. I just got off um, fucking what's it called? Preset share. It's like vital, but oh, I yeah. haven't done anything to it. So I feel like I should really make my own one. Ah, uh, who cares? I mean, I didn't, I didn't notice, but yeah, you probably should. But no, this is definitely the fucking most annoying project I've ever dealt with. <laughs> Everything's too loud, and the fucking the, the presets haven't come. Ah, oh, fuck! My watch just bit my skin. Anyway, all right, don't worry about that. All right, so yeah, Brian, there's some bad juju on me today. I can feel it. All right, it's fine. <laughs> uh, so, so what are you doing in Oz? You're just gonna work and like do bits yeah, and yeah. Stuff? Just nice. go to like the different cities, like starting in Melbourne and then oh. working way up the coast. So it'd be Sydney, Brisbane, and then like Cairns. Oh, bro, I'm so jealous. Let me come with you. <laughs> <laughs> it seems like half England's out there at the minute, so I swear. Yeah. Oh fucked it. But your password has expired. Oh, how does that happen? It's just weird. A lot of a lot of people are in Thailand as well. Yeah, yeah. Oh I'm getting bored of Ibiza, man. It's just fucking apparently it's even more expensive this year. Like like it couldn't be fucking it wasn't expensive enough. I have a, ho a deal with a hotel. I can stay for a month for, for like a grand. So slip, but yeah, yeah. It's like in May, and like in May, it's not as like hot as so, you know. It's like twenty-two degrees. It's not like. Would you be DJing? Yeah. So I I'd make a profit going, but I think I might prioritize the academy this year, like and the therapy more importantly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because if you go out there, you just get wrecked every time. And it's like, yeah. I've done it five, four years in a row now. So this would be my fifth year. No, um, I've gone to Ibiza, but for a family wedding. Never, wow. never gone out. I was meant to go to, uh, it was meant to happen one year, but then COVID happened. Oh. And I was going to go see Chasing Status at Amnesia and like ditch oh. the wedding lot and go fucking raving. That's so lit. That's so uh, COVID like screwed it over. Fuck. I was gutted. I oh. never got to do a little solo rave. Oh, um, it's like I on the on the website. It was like fucking like 
20 you could pay 20 euros for like three Budweiser's in advance like it was just ridiculous like yeah. you could to buy your drinks on the website in advance it's like 10 euro for a bottle of water or something like that yeah so it's, it's disgusting it would have been a spenny night 100 percent. we just play minesweeper so like if people leave drinks it's actually that's kind of tapped i'm not going to recommend that but <laughs> <laughs> but uh it's just genuinely okay, and if one of us got spiked, we just kind of took the bullet. Like, it's fine. Yeah, that's a win-win. <laughs> yeah, so that's, a, that's a winning lottery, the golden ticket. I remember I got, I went to a pub where, I, like, I, think I did a six-hour set and I went to a pub. I've never told this story. I went to a pub uh, with my with the club owner and one of the bouncers. And we were, he was like, come to this place. It's called The Ship. He was like, come to The Ship. I was like, I don't really like it. It's full of fucking wreckheads, like... Like they're like workers or people who live there, like Brits, but they go to the pub and it's in Ibiza and it's just like people get so sashy. And someone fucking spiked my beer with like Mandy, no. uh, and the lights came on and I was like, "Whoa, why is it so bright?" And I was fucking pinging, bro. So we went back to the club and like just kept That's kept amazing. kept kept drinking. It was horrible though. It was funny. Like I was like, "Oh fuck, bro." <laughs> All right, what were we? Uh, but yeah, I don't know what cunt did it. Some fucking dirty cunt. Uh, anyway. That's my beat for you. Uh, yeah. Presets. Drag this in here. Presets. Yeah, this is really long winded. I've never had to do this. Um, rescan. Look at all these fucking random packs. Uh, OPM, 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 three sets. Jump, subby base. No, intro base. Intro. Okay. Did it save the automation? Of course not. Yeah. Of course not. London. I'm sure it sounded great with an automation, but we don't have it right now. So I don't know what to do about that. We might have to don't want to delete that layer, but rescan OPM. This is the Sorry. Sorry. Is that what it's supposed to sound like? Okay, sick. Jump up bass. <laughs> Jump up bass. Jump up bass. Was it you that I was meant to send the track to Lion Dub? Yeah, yeah. Oh fuck, I still haven't done that. Sorry, bro. I'll get on to that. You can you can message him, just say oh Omar said you'd be interested in this. All right, we talk a lot. Uh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not the biggest label, but I think I'm pretty sure Boo's put out on it, Dutta and stuff like that. That is pretty good. Oh yeah, mate, I know Lion Dub. Yeah, that. You've got good uh, knowledge of music as well, to be fair. Is that the whole... That's the jump up face. Like, uh, what was it? Holy Goof Girls we were talking about or something like that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I'll have to show you that set. Like, I've worked on it a bit. That's... Oh, is that the, the 140? Yeah, yeah. Like that, yeah. yeah. I feel like... We need to work on this a bit though. I reckon I, I reckon I can get this done in the hour, which is insane. Uh, jungle wobble. Yeah. Cool. Uh, the new, the new vision podcast is good. Noisiest one. They've got a lot of good uh, tracks on there. This, this, um, I think they're starting to do solo releases like, um, parts of noisier, like thighs and shit. He's doing that. Yeah. Yeah. It's a new track. So, I don't on. think you got that one, but because oh, I'll probably fog horn. make another one in the future. Okay. Oh, shall I see if I've got a foghorn to replace it with? Yeah, man. Okay. <laughs> 5,000 presets. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. A lot of cool skin as well. Oh, is that how you do it? I always <laughs> with like different different ones. 
Yeah, and that this will this will drag it in as a one shot. So whatever the sound is, it will bring it in to your project hidden button, Sweet. like as this audio. Okay, so yeah, cool. cool. I got this one from MuseRack, I think. Got Dreadnought, Dreadnought Dog Pack. Let's see what's this. All right, it's awful, but it'll do. Uh. All right, well, we'll, we'll, should we just leave it in there like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of money to get their adverts on these commercial radio stations. So the threat is being taken very seriously. <laughs> This actually needs to be louder. <laughs> the fucking <laughs> jump up bass, the first thing. That... <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, let's fucking clip it. So I reckon compressor. Drugs dealers are prepared to pay quite a lot of money to get their adverts on these commercial radio stations. So the threat is being taken very seriously. Where's the lyrical one shot? That definitely needs to be quieter. I think that's oh, it's at the bottom. All like the vocals are in the last like group. Uh, sorry, how fucking which one is it? This one? No, in like the purple group below. The oh group. shit! 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 Uh, it's that one. Oh, so it's below here. Oh, this is lyrical. Lyrical. <laughs> oh, I thought you said lyrical. <laughs> Check it's lyrical. Yeah, it's lyrical. Oh, is it? Look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I added some Maybe Jamie. You know, like Jamie tune before, um, but I just thought like a bit more of like a pirate radio vibe. No, it's good. It's yeah. good. It's good. At least you sampled Jamie. All right, so been taken very seriously. <laughs> started happening in UK raves, which was nothing to do with class, that was to do with drugs, you know. <laughs> hey, yeah. Is that hype? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I remember, uh, sorry, I keep getting sidetracked. In I, was, I supported him at the Arch, and this, this, I was, I, I was a and r him, and I brought him backstage, like, to the decks, and some kids stepped in front of him. And I can't remember exactly what happened, but the kid like stepped on his shoe and he just fucking slapped the kid <laughs> and he went flying onto the fucked on sofa. I was like, bro, what have I just seen? I was like, should I tell someone? I was like, I said to the kid, I was like, shh, shh, shh. it's fucking <laughs> hype. I don't say shit. <laughs> this, this hour cannot go online like this is so bad. <laughs> yeah, we can I say whatever. Like, um, he's like uh, a Melbourne drum and bass group. And um, they just had Goldie in, and apparently Goldie shoved a, like another DJ down the stairs, <laughs> like yeah. off the stage. Yeah. <laughs> and that everyone was like, like, "It'd be good if someone taught Goldie how to fucking mix before he starts shoving other people." <laughs> That's so jokes. I've never uh, seen Goldie, but apparently, like, apparently he's not that great of a mixer. He's more of a, like a, a character in the scene than he is. Yeah, yeah. He doesn't make his music. Heist makes his music. Is it? 
yeah, Heist is his engineer, but he's 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 pushed the scene more than anyone. So yeah, yeah, you've got yeah, to respect yeah. that. He's way more than and an, anyone. Like he did, he's done so much for the scene. It's just he was a, it was a figurehead for for like the fashion side of things, which is yeah, yeah, yeah. so yeah, important. He did a Stussy collab recently. And oh was, yeah, was literally, bro. Like that's why I wear Stussy because he brought Stussy to drums. Like that's because of him. So he's like the Virgil Abloh, but for drums, basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's lit. People, he gets disrespected, and he is. He can be, but who can't be, especially in the drum bass scene. And like one of my friends, she has beef with Goldie's daughter because apparently, <laughs> apparently Goldie's daughter's nuts. But um, <laughs> but yeah, so it's just fucked in it. Like he's a G. Like Goldie's top G. Like fuck Goldie. Yeah, I wonder too. if she came out with gold teeth as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah that'd be lit. <laughs> <laughs> She doesn't have fucking teeth, mate. All right, so back to the project. There was a lot of trouble started happening in UK raves, which was nothing to do with class. That was to do with drugs, you know. 88, 89, 90, you know, everyone's taking ecstasy and they're all loving each other. By 1996, they're all fucking taking cocaine and champagne. It's a recipe for a disaster. But on the estate, the view that drugs are involved is expressed by many residents. If evidence emerges that that is accurate, then you may be assured that we at Stoke Newington, the police here, are determined to deal in a robust and vigorous way with misuse of drugs. that wobble correct do you reckon i feel like it should have more lfo on it something like that <laughs> uh, yeah this should be like a low pass oh, i've got a pack mate oh is it a preset pack yeah, yeah, yeah. stranger or something yeah, it was a yeah. strange one. I did a little bit there. Okay. It's better now. Bro, I can't believe I've mixed this project in like less than an hour. Like I've actually got it and then... Yeah, this is... Easy guy. The vigorous way with misuse of drugs. <laughs> Sorry, I'm doing it really quickly because we haven't got much time and I literally have a student after this and I'm teaching for like the next five hours straight, which is jokes because... Yeah, man, it's nice, no, calm. Uh, basically, what I'm doing is I'm turning the volumes down. I have like a picture in my head of like where everything should be mixed and like the, the, the panning of stuff. So I'll send this to you at a future date where like the, the hi-hats should be most panned, the bass should be in the middle, kick should be below that. There's an actual like graph of like where shit should be like according yeah, to like yeah. calvin harris or some shit but like that's what <laughs> i use as like a re as a reference uh and then obviously the all the side chains are there but there's no threshold so there's not actually side chaining so i'm just making sure everything's like side chained and that but almost there <laughs> so you see here like you want to lower the threshold obviously you can use this thing but if it's just bookie, like this is bookie as well. Like this is the the, the, the uh, old school, like the Ableton 10 one. It's worked. And then the gain reduction is like the compression.
was saying in the newspaper that we ate. My next tube's just cancelled, so do you have time to go for another hour? Or do you want me to just mix this and count it as an hour or something? Uh, yeah, man, I can do two, because I'm, yeah. I'm on holiday next week, so okay. I'll have to do next week. So what if right. I just run for a piss quick? Yeah, go, 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 go. That's fine. Oh, I've got to teach a fucking nine-year-old after this. Fuck. <laughs> so draining working with a fucking nine-year-old. I swear to God, mate, regrets. Oh, fucking hell. Fuck. Sweet. Yes, bro. All right, active. in the newspaper that we earn 50 grand, 100 grand and all that rabbish there, right? That's all, that's the blown it all up, you know what I mean? That's nothing. You can't never earn that much money out of pirate radio. I don't care what station you run. Whatever happens, I've got to still do my radio station. I'll do it for the public now. When I started, I started it to do it as a joke. But now it's, it's gone beyond a joke now. Now I've got so much listen. It's the biggest pirate radio station in London. Nice, that's a fucking massive improvement. Basically, turning everything down is giving us headroom to like work with, and then some things can be louder. Like the jump up bass is good, to loud, and then these vocals can stay on the top, the breaks can stay in the middle, stuff like that. But um, yeah, fuck me. I don't even know what to call it, man. Like a burning house or something. <laughs> it was a burning house, and I'm the fucking fireman. But it, it it's better now. I think it's yeah, yeah. It's almost playable, and then. <laughs> Now we've got to make some stuff louder like this. X amount of respect. As most Londoners are winding down for the weekend, the younger generation is only now coming to life. Two radio stations. Very, 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 very important. They played the tune on Dub Dub Dub. The DJs played it out in the club. club. It's, it's it's done, bro. Like, I'll I'll master it. We don't need to do another hour. Okay, see, see. I'll master it and I'll send it to you. I'll, I'll use the hour to to master it and then, yeah. So, are you? What's the crack next week? Are you away? Yeah, yeah. I can't lie. Before it gets mastered, I wouldn't mind working on like the 
the full corn, probably. Just okay. in, just like a... Yeah, sure. Just so it's a little bit more of like a, a personal touch, but I could always do that. I can do that myself. If you yeah. like, send this back over to me and then we'll link up when I'm, when I'm back and just do like one more lesson on this tune and then get it mastered. Yeah, look. Would that work? Yeah, look. Sweet, I, might sweet. I might have to actually charge you for master, by the way. Sorry for saying free master. I don't think oh, yeah, no, no. <laughs> Oh, yeah, just the night. Uh, that reminds me. The last track. Have you got around to mastering that yet? Oh, fuck. Have, you, have, I, have I not done it? Nah, nah. Oh, I shit. Oh, shit. Oh, it's calm, mate. It doesn't matter. Yeah. All right, sweet, not, sweet. I'm not in any mad rush. <laughs> Andy no, C's not knocking on my Boomtown up. headline set next week. <laughs> yeah, Andy C's knocking at the door like, <laughs> yeah. where's my fucking dub? He's, he's, got that, he's got that O2 show coming up and I need to send it to him. <laughs> yeah. I paid you a fire on PayPal. <laughs> I want the dub. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, it's no rush. Uh, so, yeah, so it's the desktop. And then... But yeah, just resend it to me and then I'll get it mastered, whatever, whatever it is. Don't you worry about that, bro. <sighs> what the last track is that? Send it again. Yeah, is it Bunting? I swear I mastered Bunting. Or is nah, it no, no, Special after? Agent. Oh, yeah, 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 bro. Send it to me in it and then I'll fucking... Is it oh, better to send it on WeTransfer? Yeah, 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 yeah. We, yeah, WeTransfer, oh. yeah. WeTransfer's better, bro. Um, okay, so we got that. And then uh, minimize all this shite. And then. No, man, that is one trippy background. <laughs> yeah. Like to look at that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why I have it. So I'll spend my downtime <laughs> having spiritual experiences and looking at that. Uh, okay, so, nah. It's all right. All right, so we, we transfer, man. I'm glad I got a fucking hour break. This nine-year-old, oh man, I regret fucking bringing him on. He's since I brought him on, it's just every week drains the fuck out of me. <laughs> He's so mouthy. He's like, nah, 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 nah. I'm like <laughs> not gonna fucking karate chop you know it. What's he mixing? Uh, like deep house, like I'd be for classics. <laughs> uh, get one some fucking jump up. <laughs> DJ Archie, fucking mind. <laughs> Oh, all right, mate. I'll, I'll actually, yeah, what's your what's your email, Jack? Where's... It's double A. Oh shit, sorry. Oh yeah, I got it. 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 All right, come on then. So yeah, this fucking background's nuts, isn't it? Ooh. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, I just want to put a little bit more of a, a personal touch on this one. Yeah. So you know. No, I rate that. I rate that. I mean, I that. red note stuff is. Obviously, probably going to sound better, but... No, 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 Oh, the Sounds presets. Like yeah, that was literally like a half hour mix down and it's class. Like, techers, 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 techers. All right, man. So I'm going to fucking upload that testimonial and thank you for it. No worries. And we'll see you a week after next, bro. All right, nice one, man. Hopefully you get yeah. some sun and shit like in your area. Fucking, uh, yeah. All right, man. Yeah, man. Take Love. It easy. See I'll you soon. Yeah, sweet, sweet, sweet. Love.